Malaysia Madani. So my question is, uh, what is your aspiration for Malaysia's public transport? And how do you foresee we solve the... How do you foresee we solve the horrendous KL traffic? I understand the Transport Ministry is drafting a plan, but what is your aspiration for buses, micro-mobility, bicycle lanes and such? Thank you. We have a very dynamic Minister of Transport, Anthony Lok, and um, he is coming up with a plan, public transportation, which has been quite neglected. I agree with you. The, the whole concept of development in this country is actually biased towards the rich and uh, have ignored the concerns of the general public. Public transport is a clear example. Uh, schools, health. So, I wouldn't come up with any specific uh, proposals now. We have just launched the MRT Larua and Putrajaya. But, but I think um, I would certainly agree with you and I would uh, express this to the minister that uh, we should hasten the pace um, for him to come up with a presentation on the whole policy of public transportation. Thank you. But meanwhile, whatever needs to be done fast, like buses, whatever, particularly for students, we will have to... Thank you, try. thank you, Dr. Sri. I think my, my last question is, do you have any plans to dismantle the touch-and-go monopoly in our transport and road system? <laughs> Because in, in many places, like petrol stations and parking lots, we can already pay with our debit cards. But we are still stuck with the problematic touch-and-go system. And it's monopoly. You are right. You see, touch-and-go has been in operations for the more, more than two decades. Uh, there has not been convincing or uh, development or progress in the system. And I think you are right. We will have to reconsider that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your question. Okay, we have time for one question per individual, okay?